Hey guys, welcome to True Power, man. True Power, and you saw the thumbnail, PNF for runners. Proprioceptive neuromuscular facilitation for runners. It is the best thing that any runner can do for their workout is to add these, add these uh, exercises. There's 39 of them. If you do them one right after another, it won't take 15 minutes. I suggest all my athletes do 15 minutes in the morning and 15 minutes at night and intersperse them throughout the day, your favorites as needed, okay? Or 15 minutes before practice, 15 minutes bef after practice, or 15 minutes before the meet, 15 minutes after the meet. Guys, what this does, with the proper use of tension, believe it or not, gives you strength, flexibility, and endurance in every single muscle group in the body <clears throat> in less than 15 minutes. Probably, once you get them closer to 12 to 14. Now, what is PNF? Proprioceptive Neuromuscular Facilitation. It's not going to be on the final, and I won't take off for spelling. <laughs> All right? Proprioceptive Neuromuscular Facilitation. As I said, it means literally... Proper use of tension to create strength, flexibility, and endurance in any muscle. <clears throat> okay? For some reason, this is almost completely ignored by most athletes and certainly their trainers. We gotta lift weights, man. We gotta get we gotta get swole. We gotta take the broids. We gotta get no. No. <laughs> Unless you're an offensive lineman. That excess bulk is the last thing you need. Anyway, why runners? Well, I do this for everybody. But runners for sure, man. What do runners want? Runners want unlimited energy. Unlimited energy. Literally, you never get tired. Okay? That will come primarily from the diet. Okay? It's a different video. Okay? Then, what do they need? Every runner will tell you. It's a little different with some of the sprinters. Little, some of the sprinters, you know, Usain Bolt and Ben Johnson and all them are all bulked up. They're all roided up. But they were only running 100 yards, 200 yards. So they had a little more bulk than other ones. But guys, how much easier is it going to... Are you going to be able to run faster... With the energy levels all being equal, are you going to be able to run faster weighing 180 pounds or 150 pounds? Of course it's going to be 150. Guys, you're not, you're, you're not, you are not carrying around the extra 30 pounds. If you weigh 150 pounds, get a, get a knapsack and fill it full of 30 pounds versus kettlebells and try running down the street with that on your back. But somebody that's running 100, um, weighing in 180 pounds, that is what they're doing. It might be better distributed throughout their body, blah, blah, blah. And guys, it doesn't matter if that 30 pounds is rock hard muscle or blubber. It's weight that slows you down. Now, I do not think that anorexia or anything like that is important. But guys, it is imperative that you keep the bulk off, you keep the blubber off and whatever, and you keep your energy. That is the beauty of the True Power Diet. Number one, unlimited, unlimited calories, whatever you want, okay? Fruit, veggies, corn, rice, peas, potatoes, lentils, beans, all right? Then... You want to get strong and you want to get flexible. Now, I do not have any, any of my runners, any of my runners lifting conventional weights. All it does is tighten up the muscle, gets you stiff and sore the next day, adds bulk that you don't need. Guys, that's not what you want. Okay? PNF gives you just as much strength as conventional weights. Flexibility on the same exact 
the same exact exercise and endurance. Think I'm kidding? Try it. 15 minutes in the morning, 15 minutes at night. Strength, flexibility, and endurance. Now, if you want to turbocharge that even more, you add kettlebells to it. Kettlebell is adding resistance to this foundation of Propios PNF. It is based on the, the same properties of PNF, using PNF Incorporated, but you're adding resistance to it. So it turbocharges the PNF Max. I do both, all my clients do both. Guys, you are not going to believe after doing PNF or kettlebell, whatever the case may be, how you are flying up the hill. That normally, halfway up, you'd start to grind and huff and puff, and just flying it. Get to the top and go, oh, geez, what the heck just happened? PNF, that's what happened. Proprioceptive neuromuscular facilitation. Now, I discovered this doing my doctoral thesis. It was called True Power Pitching. I have a master's degree in physiology. All my doctoral, postdoctoral work and certification is in nutrition. Okay? So the True Power diet is tried and true. Fruit, veggies, rice, corn, peas, potatoes, beans, lentils, all grains. You don't have to buy the book. I just blew myself $10. Saved you $10. Okay? I have a book for kettlebells, and I have the PNF Max for all my athletes. Guys, not only do I do this for my athletes, I work a lot with senior citizens. They're all doing PNF. Every single one of them gets results. Every single one of them. That's it. Now, here's the deal. Get with the email. At the end of this, this uh, video, shoot me an email. I'll give you my PayPal information. My PayPal is actually the same information as the email. Give me 10 bucks with your 10 bucks. I will attach it's an ebook. I'm showing you a hard drive, but it's an ebook. Okay. I will attach it to your email and you will have it today if you do that. As quick as you want. Guys, this is the best thing you can do for a runner. Either 15 minutes in the morning, 15 minutes at night, or 15 minutes before practice and 15 minutes after practice. Okay? And then just go, go, go to practice. Within a week, you are going to be so excited about the results, you're going to be emailing me back and begging me to get you the kettlebell book. Now, with the kettlebell, I would brew 15 minutes in the morning, 15 minutes at night, do a couple of these as a little bit of a warm-up before you did it. You incorporate the kettlebell, which I outlined in the book. Next level. Next level. And guys, you're on the True Power Diet. I just told you what it is. Okay? In my book, I will explain it. You get on that diet. I'm telling you guys. You will not crash at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. You will be buzzing. Your head will be clear as a bell. No downwards. Guys, you just have energy to spare. And at the end of that 10K, that 5K race, whatever the case may be, you've got plenty in the tank. Plenty. Not only with glycogen stores, but with strength, flexibility, and endurance in every single one of your muscle groups. That is true power. Love you all.